like some fucking shit. Cause y'all can't keep y'all fucking attitudes, man. <laughs> Oh, oh, Catch the ball. What's up? How you feel? What's up, bro? Is that an X here? What's up? What's up? What's up? Yo. So that's six, man. Hey. Hey, uh, hey. Uh, These guys too big, see. Oh, for real? I mean, unless it's somebody like Jaleel. That right there. Your mother and your father want to talk to you. It only work on speaker. It only work on speaker, man. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> Oh, no. Oh no, 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 yeah, he coming to the wrong. I run it over, Nemo, all that ducking. I ain't trying to score. <laughs> nah, this ain't nice, man. Yeah. Oh, brothers. Yeah, I'm back out here today with another video. No, no, I'm fucking perfect. Tutorial, how to play football. See, the play with Coach Mom. And teach them how to play football. <laughs> Yo, that guy's that oh, is no. looking pretty sexy. Yeah, it is. Like anybody can catch yeah, it. Yeah, he wants to take this. Come on. Get this guy's on. Look like he walked with just fine. Yeah, you're correct. <laughs> hey, Sai, take these off. I'll be right back. I'm gonna run. He's not like a Roblox player. Side quest, side quest, side quest. Side quest, side quest, side quest. Okay. okay. Side quest, side quest. Okay. So in the future, what do you see like is your main position? Well, I feel like my main position. I feel like I can play. I can play even position that I like want to for if I really put the work into that position. But I feel like right now I'm more of like a defensive type player. So I say like like where I was middle linebacker or uh, DM. You're yeah. more of a wide receiver, right? Of course. No. Nah. Good God. <laughs> oh no. Sorry. Bro. I forgot. Yeah, I'm bro. supposed to. Can you start with the name for the order? Alright, Christine. Thank you. you. Gotta put the government on the order. Let me get a spicy chicken sandwich. And then, can I get a frosted lemonade? Can I get an egg cow and a sun joy? Sorry? Can I get an eight count and a sun joy? Yes. Sauce for you? Uh, bottom Asian. So do I hit redeem? Yes, ma'am. Okay. And then scan the restaurant. Ah, Perfect. Cool. They're all set. Let's have a great day. Up, Is you waking I'm up, up fool? Because yeah, I be up early. early. I gotta get a wrap. Christine? Christine? Yeah. You, you know he killed his barber? What? He fucking line up up? He killed his barber. Who? You know the song? A lot of nigga beats makes Oh yeah. He killed his barber. What? I don't know. Took his hairline or something? I guess so. Don't worry. You raise the game. I'm gonna survive. Want your prize now? Have you said hash brown? Hash brown? This is an eight. This is about eight pounds. Six. We need a pretty ball, but it got out there. Oh. And put it in your uh, your joint in that thermos. Game faces, man. Okay. Oh! 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 Oh!
Yeah. Yeah. Good job, fellas. Good job. You can't go ask Coach T the question. You got to make the adjustments in game. Because when you come off, they go do something else, all right? Other than that, man, we laid it on the field, all right? Yeah. 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 We laid it on the field. We got guys that's late. We got guys that didn't Link. show up. We can't win games like that. Now you're going to next week. Are uh, you playing uh, Friday at 9 o'clock in the morning? It's the same thing, man. We need to be on time. We need to be here at 11 a.m. on Monday. Do what you need to do tonight, tomorrow, and make sure you put it right in your body so you can be ready to play football. It's a long year. Let's get on the bus. Let's get back. Anybody hurt, let's see the trainer get treatment today. If you're that much hurt, then you need to be here on Sunday to get treatment as well. All right? All right, let's get out of here. Get out of here. Get out of here. Uh, I don't want to say I'm proud of y'all, but today I really showed up. Since the I know we cried a lot for the ball and shit because we seen it. No, 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 no. You showed up especially. You showed up. Like, yeah, I feel like you really showed up today. Right. And then defense, defense, oh, the defense look good. We just all got to get to the ball. Finished, and the line, y'all look perfect. Y'all look great. I like the great. Hey, cool is on three, championship on six. One, two, three, cool. Go five, six. Yeah, no doubt. What baby at? Yeah, uh, man. Let's see what they had on. Oh, oh shit. Hey, T. Yeah, I'm all ready. All right. That's why we you know uh, linemen don't move. snippet last week about the army how they have it right how our United States Army have it right it's the army of one man we wasn't the biggest we wasn't the strongest we wasn't all that but we was the most together the most together is going to win the most together is going to dominate my teammates saved my life I wouldn't be here talking to y'all right now if we wasn't together as a team over there Y'all gotta come together, man. When you're, and another thing about me, my friends, I don't let do dumb. I mean, from the time I was a little kid all the way up to now, I'm 44 years old, and I still don't let not one of my friends do dumb. Say, Coach Daly has said a lot, and we all have said a lot throughout the weeks. Hey, before here, don't be late Monday. It's 11 o'clock. We going back to two workouts in a day. Don't be late. You might don't want to be late. You late? and you know you're gonna be late, just go ahead and stay where the fuck you at. All that night is over with us. 11 o'clock Monday. Now nah, y'all stay here. Everybody else can go. Hey, bring it in. Come on, don't you, don't you, don't you, don't you. Hey, Tay. Yeah. We gonna, we, we, we gonna bring this back like last year, man, because Danny said it, so we gotta do it. Everybody trust one. Hey, hey, good man, trust two. Yeah. Hey, repeat after me. Together. Together. Everyone. Everyone. Achieve. Achieve. More. More. Team. 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 Together. Yeah. Everyone. Everyone. Achieve. Achieve. More. More. Team. 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 God's strength. God's power. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Last out. All for one. All for one. for all. Coolest. 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 Check us out, Jalen. Hey, Coolest on three. Championship on six. One, two, three. Coolest. Four, five, six. Championship. We suit up. Don't, don't take no nothing else right now. When we suit up, 
We ain't like no running backs. We ain't no receivers. We ain't none of that, are we? No. I told you what you are to a car. Are you a door handle in a car? No. Are you an armrest in a car? No. Are you a mirror in a car? No. You a part while the car runs, correct? Yes, so that means the engine have to turn when the key turn, correct? Yes, Amen. And to stay humble, I'm going to tell you like this. That's the last time you played down in your competition. Do I understand that? Yes, coach. I'm, I'm not mad. I'm more disappointed than mad. It's like me knowing that my daughter can spell and she had fell a spelling test. Oh, daddy had the easy words. I just, I know how to spell it. Do that supposed to make you feel good? Cause she know how to do it, but she didn't do it. Do it, I'm asking. Because y'all are acting like her. I know you know how to do it. I gave you more tools under your belt as an offensive lineman than any coach in the DCI AA gonna give anybody. Have you learned any half that I taught you so far? No. Have your coach ever coached you like me? No. He said, I'm a gorilla in a suit. Finna pull up in a who who is you? Oh no. Oh. Bring it in, bring it in. It's cooler, you know I me. Mean? You go. Game day, you go. Oh, I'm really number zero C, yeah, and they telling me I'm not a captain. Because I got, because I put my shoes. Bro, you're a captain, bro. You're a captain, bro. You're a captain, chill. Ah! Huh? Say something to the peoples. Kind of right there. Freedom Saturday. We find through adversity. How much days is that? A couple hours, man. It ain't no days. It's hours now. Yeah. This is scary hours, man. We gotta see what how that. I ain't gonna lie to you. Dog. <laughs> My magic bar got on some big ass socks. See you on the sideline, y'all. Hey, let's go, y'all. Let's go. Okay, let's don't talk about nothing. My man, sweet, though. My man, sweet. My man is sweet. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. <laughs> Two more days, man. Uh huh. One of y'all. One of y'all. <laughs> Dirty. Get inside. Get inside of it. What the fuck? What the fuck? Catchy. Hey, that's why we do the drill. Catchy. You can see what you just did. You 
ain't look back. You there you go, Tommy. There you go, Tommy. Hey, oh, 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 oh. My name is John Freeman. I'm the athletic trainer here at Coolidge High School. So in high school, I actually wanted to become a dentist. And uh, after a shadowing experience that didn't go so well, I wanted to stay um, with medicine, a form of medicine, and I wanted to be in sports. I always wanted to be in sports. So after doing some research, found out what athletic trainers were. And um, in college, when I got to college, I went to Howard for my undergrad degree. Um, I majored in sports medicine. So I always wanted to be somehow in the scientific role of sports. Yeah. So I've always I've always been a big sports person. Um, wanted to play, wanted to be involved any way possible. When I was younger, I played you know youth football, youth basketball, and uh, when I got to high school, I knew I knew I was going to be in sports. And part of the reason why was because I never wanted to wear like dress up clothes to work. I always wanted to wear like sweatpants or shorts and stuff like that. The importance of my job and most secondary school athletic trainers is that we are the first line of healthcare for our athletes. And what that means is, is that once the school nurse or school doctor is gone, once their workday has ended, the athletic trainers have primary responsibility of medical care. And so if you think about it um, from a perspective of if a kid gets hurt after school and the nurse isn't here, who is going to tend to that child or that athlete or that patient. And fortunately, uh, this high school has an athletic trainer. And so from, the, from a medical perspective, that's my job is to come in and fill that role of the healthcare after school or the healthcare uh, at traveling events. Um, if the other school doesn't have an athletic trainer or if they don't have medical personnel, that's where I come in. That's the importance of my role to make sure that kids are able to participate as safely as possible and get home as safely as possible. Some of the worst injuries, uh, when I was in, still in grad school, I had a kid pass out um, from sickle cell. And that was one of the scariest times. You know, I'm the grad student. I kind of know what to do, but not all the way sure. Um, this could be a life or death situation. So it's, it's a, it's, it can be a hazard, um, you know, a person's blood clots too quick, sickle cell, kind of prevents them from breathing as normally as they should, things like that. So any, any fracture is serious. Um, I've had a few. Any injury is, is kind of scary. Um, but as far as, you know, students coming back, I've always had that optimism that I could get kids back, I could work kids back into their progression if I had enough time. Um, sometimes I've been wrong. Sometimes the, 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 the science in the body has proven me wrong, but I still want to go forward with optimism and encourage the kids that, you know, as hard as they work, that it's going to take time, but it's possible. It's possible to get back. Tonight, check all that stuff tonight, because on Saturday, all of us are focused on the game. So I need y'all to focus on what y'all are supposed to do. So tonight, say, oh, I don't have knee pads. Maybe I should go get some zip ties, whatever the case is all of that stuff for saturday i know a lot of y'all been eating fried foods and carry out and all that stuff water all water i know y'all don't think since it's happened yet that it won't happen but i promise you i promise you it's gonna be some cramps you can't use you if you're cramping up and I'm, i promise you they telling the same thing down there at freedom so start putting the work in early hydrating getting rest all those things that you should be doing every day, start doing them now. If COVID was there, I probably would have been getting it. Oh yeah, like 20, you that.
gonna say disappointed. What? BJ, watch that eight back! We don't lose. I meant to tell you yesterday, right? Uh huh. Um, the news coming up here today to uh to interview. You be at the school. You gonna be at the, you gonna be done by eleven. By eleven. They gonna be there eleven thirty, but I want you to be there early to put on some coolers. Yeah, I'll be I'll be there by eleven. All right, bet. Uh, also, text me a long number. All right, I got you. And, and, and Thomas put it on the vlog, too. See, this is our See me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'll meet you guys at 11 o'clock. All right, I got you. See what's up. Oh, you have, yo. Donuts for $2. $2 donuts. Bro, these used to be like 50 cents, bro. Here? Shh. Oh, nah, nah, you rolling yours up. I only get on pants, yo. Why don't you offer? I got to get the interview real quick. Miss Isaac. Nice to meet Matt you. Hello. And this is Jalil Anderson. Nice to meet you. Y'all probably media got Thomas. Awesome. Yeah, so, nice to meet you. So, Miss Isaac is going to be asking you guys a few questions. She's going to ask me some questions too for God and y'all. Oh, yeah. Okay, do they know anything about the... Nah, break it down to Okay, cool. Break it down to So, I love your short. Thank you, I appreciate it. And are your jerseys new? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Nice, love it. This is the first season? Yeah. Cool, first game tomorrow? Mm -hmm. Nice. How are you feeling? Good. Good. What are your roles on the team or positions? Uh, I'm a captain. I play receiver. It's a DB. DB is a bat. Okay. Oh, I joined the team. It's my fourth year. I'm a senior, so. Awesome. Good stuff. What about you? Um, captain. I play strong safety. Yeah. Running back in my first year. I'm a senior, too. Awesome. Good stuff. And what about you? It's my second year. I'm a sophomore. Awesome. I play wide receiver. Cool. How are you feeling about the upcoming season? Feel pretty confident. I think it's gonna be it's gonna go good. Underdogs, we're gonna shock everybody. For sure. You excited? I really just can't wait. I, just, I don't know. I can't express. I can't even express it. It's, it's, that's how exciting. It's like we're just gonna express how I feel. I'm Miss Isaac. I am the deputy press secretary for DCPS. So I work on the communications team, and we've been working with DCPS Athletics to announce new rules for the Stars and Stripes division. And I'll let your coach really get into what that means for you all. Um, but essentially, as a Stripes team, Coolidge now has the opportunity to be promoted to the Stars division um, by winning two consecutive. Um, turkey bowls. So I've been going, I, I was just at check to speak with their team and now I'm here with you all to just kind of get um, your reaction to what that means and if it influences your motivation and your drive for the new season at all. Once I got that vocal, Kevin, I want to tell y'all. So after this season, if we win the gravy bowl, as you guys probably already know, we move up to the price of it. The rule has changed since that part. Every, whatever team wins the Gravy Bowl two out of the last three years will move up to the Stripes, the, the Stars division, and that last team will move down. Last year, so we can like get the Stars right now. But um, I just, I don't know. I'm just, I'm very excited. I'm very excited for the uh, class 25 and 26 and 27. They get a chance to play in the Stars. I think it's a blessing for the younger guys so that they can um, compete at a high level. Um, me being a senior, it won't really benefit me, but I can make my benefit from playing this year to benefit everybody else. Oh, Coach T did? No, Mark did. All right, but I need you on punt return, though. Let's go, one kick, let's go, let's go. Ball, ball, ball! Gentlemen, 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 gentl
Give me a loss. I want to go in the second and 12, man. Dude. That's where you got to be every time. Go. Hey, D hey, you might be the last man. Malachi gonna get this. D up here, man. D up here. Hey, D up here. D up here. D up here. Come on, man. Come on, man. Translate right over the mob, man. Green 18. Green 18. Oh, yeah. Hey, that's your one. We all right. We coming right back at you, Green 8. Grade 8, we coming right back at you, Grade 8. Third stool. Lock in. Lock in. Lock in. We two. We hit the steps. We hit two. We hit the steps. After the game, the Freedom game, my whole thing was to make sure who was with us and who wasn't. When I schedule games like Freedom, which is number three in the DMV, we schedule those games just to see where we are because we're a young team. We got a bunch of ninth, tenth graders. Our quarterback is a first year guy. So the only way you can know what type of team you have, you got to play the best. Unfortunately, we missed one of our goals, that was to be undefeated, but we still got other steps to go. So a lot of guys was down on themselves. And um, as you guys seen in training camp, I was hard on the guys, but doing games, I'm not hard on because games are hard itself. So our job as coaches is to pick the young man up. So a lot of the young man was down, but it's football. You know, football, is, that's the thing about football. You put it all in, you put everything you got into one game. And if you fail, that don't mean it's the end of the world. You still got a chance to get back on that ladder. So unfortunately, we started 0-1, but our division play hasn't started yet. So now we got to get back to the drawing board and start doing a lot of small details and, you know, reboot to get to uh, where we need to be. But um, no disrespect to Freedom, man. They wasn't 40 some points better than us. We just weren't ready. So we got smacked in the mouth. As coaches, we weren't ready for it. As players, we weren't ready for it. And that's a part of the game, man. So one thing I know, you don't make excuses about losing. When you lose, you lose. When you win, you win. But one thing about me, I, I, I hate losing more than I love winning. Like, that's just what it is. Alright, listen up, man. Hey, check me out. Listen up, listen up. I want everybody understanding. Alright, we, 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 the thing about football, sometimes, alright, sometimes you get plunged in your mouth. And we can, we can go and we can make excuses and say what this should have happened, what that should have happened, but everybody be a thumb guy. Starting with myself. Starting with myself. Alright? I think they were 40 some points better than us. Alright? So some things, I, I, my preparation the next two weeks was a little more laid back. Because I felt we put the work in, I felt we was a better team. I can't blame Coach Mike, Coach Lou, nobody. Now what I did like, what I, what I saw, I liked the fight at the end by our, our scout team guys going up and getting a f hit. I like that. So why we picked this game? Because I want my kids to be respected. All right, so I don't know about DC Gridiron and DMV and all that bull. We still gonna do our same thing. All right, they scored two touchdowns on us, man. Everything else was us, man. Hey, Jalen. Hey, man. I'm gonna see how you do th this week. All right, listen. If you would have came out there, been striking your first ever high school football game as a quarterback against the number three team in the area, 
Shorty, I, I, I wouldn't, I wouldn't, I wouldn't, I didn't expect you to play good. I'm sorry. I think you could play better than that, but I didn't expect you to, I know the crowd was, it, I know I played. You wasn't ready for it. That ain't your fault. But what you gonna do this week? What you gonna do tonight? Mm. All right? What y'all receivers gonna do? <laughs> Big guys, y'all satisfied with that? Yeah, yeah, you a little pissed off? But hey, we got another opportunity next week. Freedom Show, freshman, where you at? But, but, hey, let me see that football. Brandon, Brandon got it. I don't see the guy. Who, who got, got that ball? football? I thought I seen the football. I ain't seen no football, I might be lunch. Where you at, Brian? Hey, stand up, young. I seen that shit. That was fight, y'all. That's what you need to be young. Young, young, I ain't great. Step up, stand up. You got going to school, they gonna laugh at you, social media, I don't, I don't care about that. With an outfit. Yeah. We put the work in. Mm -hmm. All right. So let's just stay right here. Let's so unite, y'all. That we proud of y'all. Let's go, y'all. We a team. Let's go. Everybody tight. Oh, really? Coolies on three. Championship on six. One, two, three, Good. four, five, six. Championship. Big attack. Y'all 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 att
Hey, look, dog. Everything we went through for the last five, four, five weeks, man, get taken out today, man. Be serious about shit, man. Bring like up, I said, man. every game, man. Yeah, man if you said you better mean it, if you said you better play like it, man. Let's go! 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 Let's go!
Understand this, right? We got a lot of lot, lot of guys left scholarship money on the field, right? Yep. Interceptors, fumbles. Yep. Starts on Monday, though. All right. Starts in on Monday. Ben, time. Stand in your class and don't leave the bill. Yes, sir. Hey, hey, hey. Score the joint three, championship on six, one, two, three. Four, five, six. Yes, sir!